fly, securing a haste, and I don't think this Dax has got a good way out of this gank. No, I'm actually surprised that wasn't spotted. He should have seen that happen. Um, I, I know the Enchantress was smoke, but still, you know she's on the map at crit. Yeah. But no, he had a ward there. He should Puck and Doom. Yang has a little bit of mana. He did put a point into wall at six. Doesn't have a point to vacuum, oddly enough. Let's see if they're going to be able to find a target. There's the coil on to fly. Fly silence. Not going to try to TP away. Yep, bashed out of it. And he will get off an earth spike before he drops, but he drops nonetheless. So we end up seeing DGR find their way onto the board. In mid, in the meantime, looks like there was a kill onto the Witch Doctor. Yeah, we've seen him stack some of the jungle camps, and then the one successful first blood, but it has been a much quieter Enchantress performance than what we saw earlier in the tournament. If anything, today we've seen a number of Enchantress picks just not work out too well. Yang in some trouble, speaking of not working out too well, hanging around in the wrong part of town a little too long. Now, if they can get this tier one tower off, that, that will be the important objective that OG have been aiming for for some time. Miracles rotate up top, and it's pretty much entirely to try and secure the tower. They didn't need him for the kill, but to make sure they get this tower as well, he is needed. Comes to ZPN, short of level 6 on the Doom. However, there's the Life Stealer. Manages to grab No Tail with the open wounds. No Tail doesn't have his ulti. He's going to be able to brought down by the Seder, as a matter of fact. And now there's a two-man or a spike going to buy some time. He, he hit 6 in the middle of that. He actually was short of it, but when that fight broke out, how is this going to be enough? It's going to be close. I think he... It's okay. Yeah, he'll yeah. survive. By hitting that impale. Thanks, Mikos is there. We can see the trap beginning to close. This crit is set up with his menagerie of creeps. No tail right there to the north as well. DDC hanging out, not yet level 6. He's going to throw the cast. That's going to slow the creeps down and do a fair amount of damage. That's probably going to be enough to actually turn this away. And now they're going to go ahead and chase them down. Crit's going to be caught with the coil. Miracle in the meantime engaging. Very low health is going to be bursted down by Fly's finger. And now they're going to try to turn this around. DDC did manage to get away just by the skin of his teeth. Searing chains did not go off in time. Fly is going to be very careful. Someone TPing in, that'll be Yang. And they're going to go for it. Yang did get the soul ring off, so even looking at less health than he would have had to work with otherwise. And now FY actually wandered into harm's way as well. Caught between two towers. Don't worry, that won't be a problem anymore as the tier one drops. Just patient play. They had the vision there, so they don't just have to jump on the Doom who they see first. They want to wait to make sure they can get more because they had such a, a positional and vision advantage. They wait till they see the more important target, the Darks here. They kill him before he even gets a chance to use mech, and then they get the subsequent kill. Oh, here we go, he's gonna come out, and there's the Life Stealer bomb. Flies immediately bursted down, and now just look at him go to work. Crit just being brought down bit by bit. Here we go, coming in from the back is gonna be Moon though. Death Ward canceled by the Bad Rider. Now they're gonna turn back on him, so a valiant effort out of VGR, but ultimately gonna result in a triple kill going to the one person you wish you did not give it up to. That Ember Spirit played by Miracle. Really love the gutsiness of it all, but blows up in their face in a big, big way. Yeah, I'm looking to contest VGR who have a lane ward, and again, these wards being bypassed, really great smoke use from both teams. And here we go. They're gonna hook up with Yang. Yang, level 10. So short of his level 2 ultimate, and here we go, Miracle's going to go on in, and be caught out, he's silenced out, and now it's in, just chopping away, here comes Moon, though, lasso on to Yang, Miracle manages to make it out of the line of fire, great earth spike coming out of Fly, seems like I'm saying that a lot these days, Miracle doing what damage he can, trying to keep himself safe, bad from behind, doesn't matter, because he's able to chase down and find that life stealer, send them packing, next on the list, FY, and Moon there with the flame break, just to secure the kill, that's going to be 4 down, and I agree, Miracle, unstoppable on this Ember Spirit, still has not lost that Aegis despite two huge team fights. But it's also just a possibility for Fly, so I don't see FY getting much out of this Shadow Blade pickup. Uh, Ideally, if I, oh, as I say that, he's going to probably just find a free kill, so <laughs> what, am I, what do I know? Uh, in terms of a team fight setting, he's not getting anything out of it, but you're not picking this for team fights, you're, well, you're and, getting this for the pickups. Well, and this is also just one of those things where you're revealing that item, oh, almost got Oh my gosh. That would have been bad. But I mean, now that they know it's there, they're going to play a little differently. They're going to play a little more cautiously, and there's going to be the phase shift on Moon. Actually, manages the waning rip and coil him. However, here comes some help. Because of blade breaks there. Moon Damage there. Uh, lasso. Whoa, oh, man. Uh, the rich get richer. As BGR loses two at top, they did end up uh, picking off the Ember, but ultimately...
Fury at Yasha. No, they actually didn't get the Aegis down. VGR are just waiting on the high ground to the north, hoping to find a pickup in this area. They're not in the high ground. They want to get the flank on. Now they're going to try to come in from behind. Moved in a perfect position to scout it. FY coming in. Here we go. No Tail's going to shape shift. And there's going to be the vacuum. Wall's actually off the mark. Fly gets the finger off, and Yang's going to drop in a hurry. Doom did go off on Miracle. FY taking damage from Crit in the meantime as FY trying to chase him as best he can. The Bower is a creep, and in the meantime, they manage to take the Ember out of the fight. Doesn't matter as the Wolves, the Creeps, and Big Daddy No Tail going to work on the racks, the main target of priority. It's a three for one as of now. And Miracle back into the fight with the Ember Spirit after healing up. GG's going to be called. Another game three, OG a bounce back once more, and it's the Miracle Ember Spirit. It's one OG, three games total today, and you've got to imagine that's going to be like maybe a high priority ban going into this final game. Well, I can't say it was a close one. Um, this one, once again, a lopsided victory, just with a script flipped, just a bit.